Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to another math lesson. Today, we will be learning how to solve word problems with ascending and descending order to 200. My name is Mrs. Cunningham, and I am happy you are here today. Let's begin. Let's look at some vocabulary. Ascending order is when the numbers are getting bigger. Example, 174, 175, 176. We start with the smallest number and end with the biggest number. Descending order is when the numbers are getting smaller. Example, 145, 144, 143. We start with the biggest number and end with the smallest number. Remember, Descending goes down, but ascending goes up. When solving word problems, you must understand the word problem, make up a plan, solve, then don't forget to check. Let's practice solving word problems with ascending and descending order to 200. Read with me. There are 172 oranges, 125 limes, 196 pears, and 169 apples on a delivery truck. How would you write these numbers in descending order? When solving word problems, first we must ask, what is the problem asking us to do? This problem is asking us to write the numbers in descending order. Next, we must think of a plan. We are going to use place value to help us figure out what numbers should be written down first, second, third, and then fourth. All of these numbers have the digit one in the hundreds place. So, we must go to the next place value position, which is the tens. Now, the numbers have the digit seven in the tens place, the digit two in the tens place, the digit nine in the tens place, and the digit six in the tens place. Now remember, we are writing these in descending order, which means I am going to begin with that digit that is the highest in the tens place. The digit that is the highest in the tens place is nine. So I will write 196 first. The next one will be 172. Then I will write 169. And last, I will write 125 because the digit two in the tens place is the smallest. So, the numbers 
are now written in descending order. Here we have 196, 172, 169, and last, 125. Great job, everyone. Now, you must go back and check your answer. Let's practice some more. Mr. Jackson wrote the page numbers 138, 133, 131, and 135 on the board for homework. How would you write these numbers in ascending order? When solving word problems, we must first ask, what is the problem asking us to do? This problem is asking us to write the numbers in ascending order. Next, we must make up a plan. Our plan is we are going to use place value to help us write these numbers in ascending order. Let's look at the hundreds place. All four of these numbers have the same number of hundreds. So, we must now look at the tens place. Look at the tens place. All four of these numbers have the same number of tens. So we must move on to the ones place. Look at the ones place. The four numbers have a different digit in the ones place. Here I have written down all the digits in the ones place in ascending order. This is going to help me to write the four numbers correctly. The first number I will write is the number that has the digit one in the ones place. That is the number 131. Next, I will write the number that has the digit 3 in the ones place. That number is the number 133. Now, I will write the number that has the digit 5 in the ones place. That number is 135. Last, I will write the number that has the digit 8 in the ones place. That number is 138. We have now written the numbers in ascending order with the smallest number first and the biggest number last. You did such an amazing job today, everyone. Until next time, bye.